It was first light on August 1st, 2021, so the course participants were eager to find a deer. After running steadily for much of the night, it cleared just after first light. I applied all the relevant overlays to determine where the deer would be in these conditions, then moved to a vantage point overlooking that spot. Within a minute, I spotted a hind and a calf. Participants were glued to them because most had not seen an unalarmed samba until this very moment. They noted how she was constantly alert, ear swivelling this way and that, nostrils drawing in scent, testing for the slightest width of a lurking foe. Participants were amazed at how she stood in the same place for almost an hour without moving anything except her ears and nostrils. Several reacted with, now I understand why I always spook them and rarely get a glimpse, let alone a well-aimed shot. How amazing is this zoomed in slow clip of this hind displaying her alertness whilst inhaling air in an attempt to detect the slightest whiff of a predator. Continue watching until the end for more of my photos and observations of this hind and calf. I explained why they were in this spot and the overlays I had applied to find them and much more. After an hour, my imitation of a squealing calf spooked the hind who responded by zigzagging up the steep face. When she reached the spur line, one blast on my whistle made a stop in her tracks long enough for me to snap this photo before she disappeared over the top. Unlike some calls, the Fox 40 sonic blast whistle stops unalarmed samba in their tracks every time sometimes even when they have been spooked. Finding Samba by applying overlays is not voodoo magic. It's based upon how they respond with a high level of predictability to every type of weather, time of day, hunting pressure and much more. <laughs> 